So speech to text is a great feature on my iPhone, but I find that I don't really use it too often because when I do use speech to text, I tend to ramble or I, I'm not quite sure what I want to say. And in the end, me having to go and edit the text that I transcribed tends to take more time than it would be just to sit there and type things out. Well, I'm going to show you a new app today that will hopefully make all of this easier, and that's called Letterly. So Letterly is the app that will turn your speech into well-written text. It uses AI. It's almost like speech to text on steroids. Now you can find Letterly in the App Store for Apple or in the Google Play Store as well. So let me show you how Letterly is going to work. So once you open Letterly, you'll see a few suggestions at the top that will give you ideas on how you might want to use the app. But if you're ready to just go in and dictate, you can push this button right in the middle of the screen. Right now, I'm going to be showing you an app called Letterly. I think it really will make your life easier. The first thing you do is tap the button and begin dictating what you want to say. It's going to be very similar to using the speech to text feature on your phone. After you're done, you can push the stop button. Letterly will then transcribe your text and that's where the magic really begins because you'll have the option to choose from a number of different options. You can either make your text more concise, you can make your text more clear, you can expand your text, you can write it as a professional email, or you can even change your text into a social media post. Now I'm going to push stop. So as I said, in that in that short brief it will then transcribe the text this is everything that i said a second ago okay so i can go in and edit that if i want by just tapping it and i can change anything if things did not transcribe correctly but i mentioned before that the magic is right over here in the middle at the bottom of the screen where it says rewrite so there's many different options that you have here in this menu to rewrite that text that you dictated into your phone that i dictated into my phone so i'm going to choose this one i'm going to have this significantly rewritten so it is more clear so again when you're doing this it's really easy to, to repeat yourself letterly is going to fix that for you as you can see this was my original this is the revised version now some other options as well if you want to make this shorter you can see it's going to preserve the content but just make the text a little bit shorter again a really nice feature that literally does this for you it's, it's gonna save you a lot of time especially if you're like me and you tend to have to go in and edit any speech to text that you have dictated but what i really like is down here at the bottom there's a few interesting features like this one i'm going to choose the option that says structured and once i select structured it took what i said and it made it into a number of different bullet points. Again, if, if this is just a list like this, like a list of instructions, sometimes it's easier to read this as a bullet point or as a list rather than a paragraph or a block of text. So a really nice feature there. And then if I go to the bottom, some great things that's in here, you can see if I just want to take this, this, this dictation that I did about Letterly, I can automatically transform that into a casual email so in a second i should see that casual email here it is you'll notice that the title is just hey there this is maybe something that i'd send to a friend okay the other option on here is for me to change this to a formal email so some really nice features that are available in letterly if you saw at the bottom i mentioned this earlier there are options for you to transform your writing into a social media post so a great example is right here on twitter or x it's going to take everything that i said and reduce that down i believe this should fit in the character limit on x of a post now there's also an option where you can take a longer 
if, if you can't fit everything in one post, there is an option to transform your text into a series of threads. You also have this option to create a linked in post as well. So a great way to repurpose content without you having to actually go in, rewrite things or even copy and paste things into, into like a chat GPT. This makes it so much easier for you. Okay, now a couple different options that you can see at the screen. Once your text is rewritten the way that you want it to be set up, there are options for you to copy the text at the bottom left-hand side of the screen, or you can push the share button and you can share this to a number of different areas. Now, as far as pricing, Letterly is a free download, but in order for you to use this service, you do need to purchase a subscription plan. But one of the really nice things that I like about Letterly is you do have the option to sign up for a free seven day trial. And hopefully that gives you enough time to decide if this is going to be a tool that you see yourself using a little more often. Before I go, I do want to show you one other really cool feature of Letterly. As you start on the main screen, if you look right up at the top, you can even see there's an option that you can book a 30 minute call with the founders to talk about ways that this app can possibly be improved. So I haven't done that yet, but it is a great feature um, as a user to be able to speak with the person that created this app. So the name of the app is called Letterly. You can find it in your app store. I do think it's a great way for you to take advantage of the speech to text feature and to hopefully save you time and to make your life a little easier. So thank you so much for watching this video. You know what to do. If you have questions, leave them in the comment section below. And if you like this content, it would be great if you could subscribe. Thanks and have a great day.